nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. What's up, guys? I got a request for a throttle adjustment video. If you have a, an engine, the uh, KL series engine that is idling up and down and doing the bouncy idle thing or stalling when you come up to a stoplight, then I will show you the four, yes, four different adjustment points that you have on one of these throttles. So first you have your idle adjustment screw. It's a Phillips head screw in the top of that. Then you have a adjustment screw here that adjusts the slack for tip in. Then you have another adjustment here, which is the stop for when the throttle plate itself is closed. That's what it stops against. And there should never be a point where this bracket touches that. So if you have that open a little bit, what it'll actually do is hold your throttle open, which increases your idle. And then the fourth is down here. Normally this is never messed with, but this guy right here is your throttle cable. And this piece right here is a lock. If you pull it, then you can actually rotate this guy. See the little white paint? That is where it's set from the factory. But if you rotate this, hold on guys. If you rotate this, then this whole thing goes in and out. And that piece right here, which snaps into this piece right here, think about it, you're adjusting where the base cable length is going to be. So if that is adjusted back, then regardless of what you do to these guys, it's still going to hold it open slightly. So in any situation, what I normally do is pull this all the way down, especially if I'm working on a car that, know, that I don't know what that person has done has had done to the car before. So you adjust this all the way back, lock it in real quick, put it in, put your throttle body on, adjust this screw all the way out, then put the cable in, see where everything sits, set that, adjust this back in to where it almost touches, then back it off like three quarters of a turn. Then on this, screw it all the way in, then unscrew it three quarters of a turn, and then start your car. And that should be your base idle adjustment. This guy right here, you should only adjust it if you have more than that amount of play. See right there? And all that is is an adjustment for the cable. When you pull down, it just takes up the slack. That's all it does. So don't really worry about this one too much unless this is flopping around a lot. Questions? Let me know.